Yeah. Yeah, that's me. We got volume controls. We got a drink. I've got slippers for slipping. I've got a completed save of Resident Evil 4. Uh-oh. And I have no signal! Now I've got signal. Hello, are the slippies com slippies comfy? Yeah, they are. They're um they're falling apart in a huge way. So that's a concern. Um uh-oh. We've got all that, and did you see what else we got? Did you see that flicker? My PS5 has been doing this and it's driving me driving me nanners. I had to restart every time I wanted to play Resident Evil 4. Maybe it's not gonna be an issue. Oh, I saw it. Let's let's restart this and hope the stream don't break. Let's just see if this works. I think it should work. Ch -ch 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 yeah, says Suze. Hey, uh, we're gonna be talking about this uh, game again. We talked about it on the GDC episode, which if I recall, everybody's sole review was perfect audio. Thank you very much. Um, but uh, I know Leo's really hot on it. And I think Janet's really hot on it too. And we haven't really talked about it on the main show. So that's what we're going to be doing uh, on this week's episode of the podcast. In addition to a bunch of other stuff. Uh, just so y'all know, we're not going to be talking about uh, Final Fantasy 16, that state of play. We're going to be doing a reaction stream. It's probably going to be um, Sarah and I doing a reaction stream for that. That They just announced that's happening Thursday, right? Um, with the state of play. So we're not going to be doing that uh, on the main podcast. But we just talked about 16, God, with the PAX recaps. So not that long ago at all, right? Uh, you all you all played Chia? I'm enjoying it. Um, <clears throat> playing on PS5. Had a couple nasty bugs. Uh, but I have multiple saves and kind of got around those. Y'all been playing this thing? And so, yeah, there's a couple things, a couple quests that I could go on where I'm like, I don't exactly know exactly where to go, exactly. I didn't play it, but it's on the wish list. Okay. Gonna give it some more time to get fixed up. I guess the, um, I guess the Epic version on, on PC, because it's just on the Epic thing. Um, I guess that wasn't that bad. You watch Kyle Bossman first play? How do you do? Oh. Hello, Mama. We are in a different spot than I imagined. Where is my boat? I should have saved before I restarted. Oh, how foolish I am. Last I remember, I was around this area. So the the fun thing about this game is they don't show you where you are, which is an interesting little wrinkle. Does this sound weird to anybody? Does sound weirdly really muffled? You all hearing that? Did finish Dredge. Yeah. Um, God, I, uh, I need to keep going in Dredge. I've really been enjoying it. It's been a great uh, Steam Deck game. But I was like, well, that's my game to play in the morning uh, when I'm on my exercise bike. But uh, but now it's like nice outside, at least in Minnesota, for a couple days. I'm like, ah, oh, who needs an exercise bike? You know what I mean? You know what I'm saying? Yeah, this audio's jank, isn't it? Disable 3D audio. Where's your 3D audio? Oh. 3D audio for TV speakers. God, that'd be silly if that's what it was. But look, dumber things have happened. Hang on. Is this it? The sound did change. It absolutely did change. Let's see. Good call. Good call, Adidan. 
God, now I'm just too up in my head. Now I'm just too up in my head. Because it still didn't sound great. It still didn't sound great. But I do think it is better. That's really odd. We'll take it. We'll take it, Adidan. Thank you. Is that the name? Yeah, Adidan. Oh. I just saw that uh, the movie Air, the Ben Affleck movie about Nike, and they're talking about Adidas, and they're like, yeah, you know, Adidas, all day I dream about sex. It's cool, it's a cool brand. And I don't know if I'd ever heard that before. Has everyone heard that? Just like the jokey acronym for Adidas? I'm gonna leave my raft here. I was trying to do that. All right. Um, the movie is good. The movie is good. It's like, imagine like a hokier, but a lot funnier version of Moneyball. But like, if you like the movies like Moneyball, Social Network, it's in that arena, but certainly not as good as any of those movies. You know what I mean? Uh, just to be very clear. But it is like, it was a lot better than I thought. It was, it's just like a fun, a fun movie. Um, it's, it's surprisingly funny. Is Chia 30 frames? Didn't they give an update to make it 60? Let's focus on the frames now, everybody. Yeah, Bobby Kotick isn't in this one. Okay, so we're trying to find Chia. Bobby Kotick isn't in Chia. Oh, so these are pearls here. Let's head over there. So we're heading northwest here. And the boat can come. We need you, boat. Um, I think... Yeah, this is probably going to be a better... Hey, buddy. Hey, little boar buddy. Can we get out that way? I guess not. So to get the boat out, do we need to go all the way back? Unless... I wonder if there's going to be a dock over there. Let's try just going north up the river. See how it goes. Charlie says, all day I dream about supporting Minmax on Patreon. Oh, my God. You mean a deed... A Adidas mop? Yeah. Yeah, Kunifu, um, where is the chicken egg? Can you help me out? I've been trying to find it in this game. In this nasty game. It is weird that the 3D audio was so impactful here, but then it wasn't in Resident Evil 4. I turned off motion blur and turned on performance mode for Chia. Oh, that's right, you can do all that. Um, let's see. You all like settings? Hmm. Was it um, was it up top? I see your motion blur there. Ah, yeah. The fidelity, let's go performance. Sweet. Oh, mamacita. Ain't that nice? Ain't that nice. This seems much better. Smooth as silk. Alright, let's um The chickens were not spawning. Okay, so the chickens should be laying eggs. Let's see. Because I've definitely, I've been around chickens. I'm around chickens right now. This village, yep. But the question is, oh, I wonder, can I like, by the way, if you haven't seen this game, it's good. Oh, because you lay an egg as the chicken, of course. That's such a good idea. Buck, buck. Buck, 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 buck. <laughs> you can fly a little bit. All right. And I think there's only one thing to do here. Find it. Did it just explode? <laughs> this game's funny. This game's so funny. All right, let's let's make it nice and easy to find. Thank you, chicken. I support you. 
Got it. All right, that took way too long. This was like four quests ago. Oh. Was I not supposed to do anything with that? That's weird. It was on the objectives list, then I got it, and then... Nothing. Okay. Well, that's fine. Uh, so we're going south to the water. Because uh, we want to get... Yep. Finished up that professional S plus run in RE4. No doubt about it. Alright, so it seems like there's going to be some pearls around here. I think you could give it as part of an offering, but you didn't need to. Okay. Thank you, Kunifu. I can see you're going to be my guide. Oh, how fun. This seems like a pearl thing. Kunifu, this isn't a pearl thing at all. Oh, hello. That's wonderful. Did I tell you that I got to swim with a sea turtle in Hawaii? Like just in the open ocean, like swimming like five feet away from a sea turtle with a snorkeling mask on? It's freaking incredible. It's like the best thing ever. All right. I respect you. I respect you, turtle. All right, they show the clamshells. Yep, okay, so I got that. Sorry, I looked away for a second. It said that I got that, right? All right, so if I had the boat, it'd be easier to see where I am in relation to all this stuff. No, you can't touch a sea turtle. It's illegal to touch a sea turtle in Hawaii. Or so the man wants you to believe. What is this over here? So that's why I'm arguing that sea turtle touched meat, bro. No, 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 we want that, we want that. Mmm. Alright, that's two. Okay, so the other one is just kind of east, but I don't really have my compass here, so. You can drop a pin on the map which helps navigate to objects. That's interesting. Let's see. But... How do we see our map if you're not in the boat? You know what I mean? I think that gets tough. Clicking the right stick. You're such a genius. You are such a genius, dude. What do you do for a living? Just help people? And people are saying compass is R1. Look, these are all great suggestions. These are all great suggestions. Oh my god. Shut up, you guys. I'm serious, there's a shark over there. I'm serious, you guys. Okay. Oh, I'll meet the chief, all right. If it's the last thing I do! Yeah! Where's that turtle? I'm looking for sweet payback. All right, shark. From the ocean to the shore. Okay. <laughs> chief! Chief, I found the pearls you wanted, Chief. That's a pretty good game, huh? Have y'all seen this game before? I don't really have a sense of how popular it was after launch, you know? Like, it's in the PlayStation uh, funky thing, but... Ooh, I'm gonna help you with something, Ben. Fellow Dome Keeper fanatic, check out a game called Wall World. I saw that. Um... It's a clone of Dome Keeper, but it's good. Okay, hang on. I'm pausing the stream. Because I saw that on Steam, and I said, what is this? This looks gross. Um, hang on. Yeah, I do love Dome Keeper. Okay, so it's Dome Keeper, but you're in a wall? Okay, hang on. Yeah, this looks pretty good. The first couple of screenshots on Steam are hot trash for Wall World, so I didn't look into it beyond that, but all right, I'm going to get it on Steam right now. It looks gross, but it's fun. But also there's a part of me where it's like, man, I had such a good time with Dome Keeper. But also it was like, that was my exercise bike game and now in the summer, I ain't got that as much. But 
I got it. All right. Purchased. Wall World. You got it. If you're the developer, congratulations. You freaking got me. Um, they cloned it. Much better progression overall. There's something kind of so simple about Dome Keeper, though. I won't have you bash Dome Keeper on this stream. I will boot you, so help me God. As God is my witness, if you bash Dome Keeper, I will kick your butt to the curb. All right, let's go meet the chief. Let's head down to river. Do you get to write off game purchases? Great question. Uh, no, I'm luckier than that. I'm a very uh, fortunate son because uh, I have the Steam Press account. So that's why shows like um, Cream of the Steam exist. Because all those games are just free and you just have to click it. <laughs> it's amazing. We're very lucky. Dome Keeper's my number three from last year. If it, man, if I would have played it before I made my top 10, I'm trying to think. I don't think I liked last year very much for gaming. I think number four for me was Mario and Rabbids. God, did I like Dome Keeper more than Mario and Rabbids Sparks of Hope? There's a chance, man. There's a chance. I, I just had a good time with that. Back to back. That'd be so messed up. But there's a chance Dome Keeper would have been my number four, now that I'm really thinking about it. But also, yeah, it, it, 2022, I wasn't I wasn't Gaga over 2020 now. Now we're talking. Okay. Let's go meet the chief. Um, Kunifu, I'm still a little confused in this game about like where I can summon my boat, how worried I should be about losing my boat, that type of thing. There are like, you can summon it at the docks. Is that right? Uh-oh. Bank right! Bank right! Bank right! Cart right! Four! Okay. Here we go. Don't worry about losing it. Because I just have to go to a dock. Oh. I thought you would want a war for rabbits for the two tens, but I get why you didn't. I thought you would would have went to war... I mean, hang on. Sparks of Hope made the two tens. I think it was decently high up, wasn't it? It was maybe like bottom two tens, maybe. Maybe. Just don't get stranded in the middle of the ocean without it. Which side is port on this raft? Good question. Ben, what if you had chat read out loud to you to avoid the constant need? Read out loud to you to have the constant need for glancing. That's interesting. I've never considered such a thing. It sounds like it'd be overwhelming and kind of distracting from the game. So hopefully it's not distracting for the stream to constantly have me be glancing over there, you know? Okay. Here we go. Favorite sailing in a game. Hmm. Never finished Wind Waker. So I don't know. I do like the sailing in this game. I like that the... Steering is different. You have to like move a little bit if you want to steer versus change the speed. I think that's really fun. And our favorite sound effect. Ooh, don't that sound nice? All right, let's go. Let's go say hi to this gentleman right here. <laughs> Hello. 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 Chia here. Chia possesses the No, okay, you can't possess humans. Let's just let's just be a rock going into town. Chief! Chief! It's a silly way to enter a tent. Two tens is my favorite game coverage, Goaty. Now that I think about it. Oh, that's nice, Danny. Thank you. I love Goaty Debates and other podcasts. I think they're so fun. So I'm glad we can be in the arena with some other outlets. That's nice. Mm. Wish I had a chief. I'm leaving. Chia. I should have done this quest a while ago, I believe. Ini la chasse na sida. Ding. Ea hunia dha kachako illa na nichem. 
Wall world, the boss is going to kick my butt. Okay, that's fine. Anybody playing Tron Identity out there? Tron Identity. Tron Identity. I was streaming it. Or not streaming it, but I was playing it today a bit. Oh, I got to charge my phone. <sighs> oh, no. Crickets. Yeah. It's it's a Disney game, man. John Drake has been tweeting about it all day. Oh, I gotta look at that. I'm I'm not on Twitter. <laughs> but I love John Drake. I think he's a really interesting dude. Um like the most interesting person in the game industry. I got an email about the Tron game and I had no idea it was a thing. It was in a couple videos, like uh what, Nindy or Disney Games Showcase, all that stuff. Get some white clay in Quayo. Where is Quayo? Is that going to be on the map? Oh, of course it is. It's, it's right there. It's right there, friends. Oh, 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 Quayo's this way. Um, so our boat's here. I mean, it's just right over there. Let's just leave the boat. Speaking of Wind Waker, it's a visual novel. It is a visual novel. It's got some animation in there. All right, you want to see the best thing about Chia? It's rocking a tree like this. Launching. I mean, come on. What is better than that? This guy's being dudes. All right, we got to get just a little bit of clay. See, I convinced you. Yes, no, maybe Joe. I've got gotcha. you. And then you can do this. <laughs> I pinch your head. A rock is faster than you, Mr. Crab. Just to drive that home. More games need tree catapulting. I agree, man. Ah! I'm in the tree! I'm in the tree! Okay. Didn't I already do this? I felt like I already did this in the game. Drink at me. You can't become the tree. Just... Just other things. I guess it is kind of confusing. It, just things that are mobile, I guess, is the best way to differentiate for what you can become. God, I wish I could pinch something big down here. That'd be really satisfying. Give me something to pinch, man. Hello? OP. OP. All right, so this is... This is where the white clay is, right? Hey, that seems like white clay. That I'm pooping on. I mean, isn't that fun? Isn't that a fun thing? Stow it. Hang on, I got that, right? I want you to stow more of it just in case. Ah, you're saying I'm full. Unstable egg. What are you doing in here? <laughs> to the sea with thee! <laughs> Hang on, actually I can use you. Wee, 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 wee. So cute. Alright, back to... This guy's fast as hell. If he's on the land. Yeah, just a pig in my pocket, no big deal. Uh, even swimming, he's way faster. Up, uh, ah, uh, bird. Yes, chief. I mean, is this a cool game? Not the best reference, room twitch, but I appreciate it. Uh, 
No! Don't make me be my stupid human form. Oh, how I hate it. Okay. Chief, you're gonna like this. I guarantee it. Oh, that was your house. Well, then you really will like it. Did you ever check out the Forza Horizon 5 DLC? No, I didn't. Um, it was pretty quiet. I saw it. It was like, what, just rally trucks or something? Like, there was a theme to it that I'm like, ah. Eh. There's a ton of stuff I haven't done in Forza Horizon 5, so I kind of know if this is going to be the thing to get me in. Um, but it's good. I don't want to paint my face. I don't want to be a painted face. Do I need to? Alright. Then full face it is. What am I supposed to be doing here? Okay. What location do I want for the next Forza? Hmm. I've been really happy with all of Forza Horizon's picks so far. Um... Alaska? I think it'd be fun for Forza Horizon, maybe? We'll see. People are enjoying that the rally DLC. That's cool. Good to know. Okay, um highlight note, plain note. Got it. A lot of music in this game, but it's usually a delight. Oh, are we gonna get taken down on YouTube because of this? Okay, so it's a different. Different register spot. It's kind of weird in a rhythm game. Oh, I gotta play that near DLC in theater rhythm. I wanna do this. Everyone looks like they're having so much fun. New show plus, we do this dance. Vote for it, we'll see what happens. I've played a lot of theater rhythm. So much music in this game. It's always delightful. Do I need the face paint to do this? I like Chia's face before. She was beautiful just the way she was, and I wish the game would acknowledge that. Just a reminder, I, I posted in the Discord about it, but um, the podcast this week, we're not going to have the live version um, for folks as it's recording because there's some embargoed stuff on it. Yeah, there is near DLC in Theater Rhythm. There's near music in it now. God, yeah, I should I should play that right now. And then I should play Wall Rider of the hell it's called. It's out now. It is out now. It is good. Excellent. <laughs> Weird rumble sound. Is something bad about to happen? Chief. Live Alive's in theater rhythm. Yep, I played through the Live Alive music already. Maybe I'll just wait for more DLC, because I think Chrono Trigger is coming in the summer, I think, so maybe that'd be a fun time to just wait for that and then go through all that stuff. I never, um, no, not through ending E for Nier Automata. I, I didn't even finish, what, the B ending or whatever? I know, I know that's bad. But yeah, I beat it and had a fine time. And then I was going through the second run and I'm like, I didn't like this game enough to play through it twice. And I understand everybody says it gets so different after that and I should beat that second ending. But I was like, eh, I'm not really into stylish action games. I'm not really into like the platinum stuff, if we're being honest. I like Bayonetta Origins from the demo. 
if that if that counts, but yeah, platinum platinum isn't in my blood, if I'm being honest with you. Carve it. Okay, so we should try. I want an eye there. And an eye there. And teeth there. Carve away every part of the wood that isn't an idol. A tiki idol. Um, right? Is that it? Validate? Oh, I guess that wasn't it. So you want me to hit everything? Maybe like the side of the wood I didn't get before? Origins definitely does not count as a stylish action game. Yeah. Yeah, stylish action just ain't ain't my bag, baby. As a wise man once said. Oh, I see. So I need to be really particular about this carving. Like teeth particular. And that nose has gotta go. Okay, maybe not. I guess that stays. like my father I mean does this stuff stay oh no okay so this one goes and then that's a nice cam camera transition by the way between those two okay easy I'm not a DMC I liked I liked a DMC reboot which I guess is sacrilegious or something um I think that's it did I do it right claw machine that's a weird thing to put in the game. Yeah, the DMC reboot is the only one that I finished. Politique. Only one I started, really. She should take off that face paint. That's scary. There's a sniping bit in the DMC reboot? I don't remember that. It's him! As I live and breathe. Let me see something. Now we gotta log in here. Oh, really? Alright, hang on. Is this gonna be one of those uh, fighty sections that I hear so much about? Kind of feels like that. All right, there we go. Now I'm actually logged in. That seems nice. Paul, you played Chia? Yes. No. Never seen it. You got one minute to vote in that poll, everybody. I don't remember the sniping part. It's messed up. There's probably a reason you block it from your brain. The sniping part is messed up? Remind me. How messed up were we talking? Just Google it? Okay. What a weird thing. Now I'm really curious. I will get the soul fruit. Googling the sniping part. Oh, what? <laughs> I do not remember this at all. No, you can bring it up. Uh, look, this is a adult stream. We're playing Chia. You kidnap a pregnant lady and you snipe her belly open with a sniper rifle? And then kill her? Jesus Christ. <laughs> 
I don't remember that at all. I, I, is it bad that I'm like, I need to go back and look at that gameplay because that is, that seems absurd. You got that so Don't eat it, Chia, you fool! Is she gonna see your dad, do you think? Uh, 31% of you have played Chia. 8% of you have never seen it before. That's interesting. I like those types of numbers. That's what we like to see. Well, I knew, I, I was I was actually upgrading it on my own, but thank you. Just doing it from exploring. Should we switch over and watch that sniping section on YouTube? That seems cool. All right. Time to bring some offerings. What is this? Okay, so that's where... Got that shrine door. Is this... So we have to carve a totem at all this stuff? This is interesting. Oh, really? All the way back here, huh? Okay. However, what if I don't want to do that? What if we went here? And so, do I have to... Is there going to be a totem there? I wonder. Well, let's just try and get up there. Rink, 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 rink. Can you food? Do you know about the totem thing? So you explain why you're playing this, Ben, for fun or for the content? Uh, yeah. I mean, a little bit for fun. It's also a thing of like, I didn't know where that chicken egg was. So every time I'm a little bit stumped in a game, like I should just stream it, and then I can get all this help. You can carve them all at one spot, then carry them all at once if you wish. And I carve them in the town. Is this where I can carve all these? I just go back and talk to the chief? Because I can get the look of these different totems. Okay. And there's going to be a soul fruit in each one. That seems like a fine thing to do. There's a few locations. Let's, let's see here. Coming in! Oh no, the rock! Oh, that's right. This is what's fun about this game. Why do I keep forgetting? Damn it, no. This isn't what's fun about the game. I need a rock to go down this hill because you can go so much faster. <laughs> Throw myself down the hill. Um, but yeah, I'm also uh, playing it because we're going to talk about it again on the Min Max Show podcast this week. Because uh, Leo hasn't gotten a chance to talk about it yet, and so it only seemed right. Uh, so the question is, the these faces to carve. Do I get them from him? I like his plasma TV in here. <laughs> uh, all right, got my boat there. Nefu says, I'm happy we're doing this for Leo. Yeah, you gotta you gotta make Leo happy every once in a while. I know no one out there wants to, but you guys, we just need to do that. I've got a new way to walk. Walk, walk. Where do I carve these things? The faces will show when you sit down to carve. Oh, interesting. Okay. And sit down to carve is something that I can do. Mm. Near here. Oh, this looks like a thing. Oh, this looks like a thing. All right, so let's see. Can you all remember this face? My phone can. And then let's, are there just gonna be these two? Are they gonna be important, do you think? Let's do it. I think, um, I think phone usage is fair game in a game. 
They knew we had this. Oh. Wait a minute. Is that just for like starting? What am I looking at? Are these, oh, these are all the different faces? Cause I think this is, yeah, this is the one that's right by me. So I should just carve all of these then, right? Is that the lesson? Okay, so we should do one side of the face first to really min-max this, because we're gonna be... We're gonna do this better than everybody. Yep, the colors help differentiate them. Okay, well let's just do the two on the island that we're on. Let's see if we can do that. Steven Spahn will be on the podcast. Nice to see people outside the normal min-max sphere. Yeah, he was just tweeting, and it's all thanks to, gosh, I forget who it was. I mean, Leafion, somebody on Twitter just tagged me because he was tweeting like, hey, I have this Able Gamers um, gala coming up, and I could use some help getting on a podcast to talk about it. And I was like, yeah, sure. Easy to do, especially like just in the community questions segment. Like, that makes total sense. So hopefully, I haven't dug through the questions yet, but hopefully people have questions for him specifically. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh no, I should have done that nostril, you guys. Uh, what have I done? I've abandoned my boy. Okay. This is not my first play session of Chia. I've played, um, I don't know, I'd be curious how many hours so far. Four? Something like that? A lot of us just been kind of dicking around. But that's kind of the, the beauty of the game, you know? It's a good just messing around game. And I know Jogra liked it, but she hated those certain segments. Is that nose right? The nose doesn't look right. That's it. Now, I'm going to keep that. And then we're going to make one more. Oh, oh, all right. Now this one, he kind of just looks like the opposite. He's got like everything covered up here. Ukulele sections are good. Yeah. Did you buy it or did you get on PlayStation um, funky bonus mode? All right. Let's see. Jink, jink. And then a little bit here. And then they don't have any eye. Seems like people didn't like or people didn't mind the combat sections. You bought it. It's pixelated. Right on. But you're playing on PlayStation. Yeah, I'm curious how many people stuck with that higher tier PlayStation thing. Like, I certainly didn't. I was ready to ready to get out. Uh, okay, and let's validate that. Do it. Green parakeet. Oh, that's really nice, though, that you can just become a bird. Can't quite get across the water on it, but... Um, not exactly there. All right, that's pretty close. Let's just go journey up here. All right, going to throw you, but then I'm going to become you. Good game. I keep telling you all, good game confirmed. Double barrel, I'm on the highest PlayStation tier. God bless you. God bless you. To each their own. Was I? Oh, I marked the wrong one. That's far away, but you know what? Let's go on an adventure. What's an adventure game without a little adventure, you know? No! I want an adventure! Okay. There's gotta be something else I can control here. I mean, I guess I'll be a rock if I need to. Hello. That's what I like. Yeah, it says not on Game Pass yet. Epic and PlayStation. It's a good get for PlayStation. Very smart little partnership here. There is a poop button. I should have pooped as the bird. There's no doubt I should have pooped as that bird. All right, let's head on up. Uh, 
Edmund Hillary here. Says, was it Edward Hillary or Edmund? Okay. This is getting a little spooky here. Come on, Chia! Come on, kiddo! Just Breath of the Wild on up there. Edmund. Thank you. Alright. Tiki House. Are you the Tiki House? Ah! Alright, we should probably get these while we can, huh? I will collect this. How far did I get in Dredge? I am, um... Oh, third island area? It's kind of like a little archipelago. And there's like a deeper pit in the middle. Do you know what I mean? And there's some big scary monsters everywhere. Um, I'm on that area. And I think I got to a point of like, I don't... For the last like two areas, there's just like big evil things. I'm like, what am I supposed to do? It just like keeps destroying my boat and I'm kind of frustrated by it. Is there some way to take those out or... Or what? Well, I don't know which one's which. Is this you? Did I have a good 50-50 guess? Is, so there is a way to, to take those out? This is really satisfying, by the way. <laughs> this, is, this is what I want from a game. This is the right level of exploration. Um, let's see. Let me see if I can remind myself. Uh, no, but you can mess with the archipelago one if you do the research quest. Yeah, I, there, I feel like there's one fish that I was missing for the re research quest there. Or maybe I got them all. I'm trying to remember. The other ones you just have to avoid. Okay. Yeah, I might have got all of them for the research quest. I don't think I was stumped by any of them, but... It got me into using a net for... Oh, I think that's what it was. It's like there's one you can only get from dragging the net in the archipelago, archipelago area. And um, and I haven't been able to get it. I've been running around for, for a long time at night and I still can't get it. But it is, I do like dredge. I need to I need to for sure spend more time with it. Reach this whole fruit without getting spotted. Oh, this is interesting. We got stealth here, folks. Good God. How are we not supposed to get... Now, does that count as getting spotted? Can I become anything? No, I can't. So... Okay, so those are the evil eyes there. Okay, so it's just like a time thing. Get down, you fool! Fool of a duck. Okay. Easy. Easy. Man, people are all in on Dredge, huh? That's that's good to hear. It's a cool game. What is happening in this world? Sometimes you like to look, but you can only look for so long. Like most things in life. Easy. Easy. Can't catch me now. This is, they, they got enough gameplay variety here. This is cool. Climb the torch. Climb the torch, sister. All right. Ah! Don't look at the chat, Chia. Come on. Have it read out loud to you. All right. I don't have my, uh, I don't have my leaf here, do I? It's like avoiding the Eye of Sauron. Yeah, it's exactly that. It's exactly that. Oh, easy. Dredge does run out of surprises about halfway through, but it's still really good. That's fine. It's just, yeah, it's such a satisfying little loop, you know? Get off the sign, Chia. You're embarrassing us. Alright, get down, 
Get down! Chia? Girl? <gasps> oh my god. That was no joke. Give me that soul fruit. Thank you very much. Pokemon Stadium's out now. Is it out now? I thought it was Wednesday it came out. Um, yeah, I definitely have that down for New Show Plus. Um, rental Pokemon only. Yeah, that sucks. But yeah, playing Pokemon Stadium in New Show Plus, that sounds super fun. I love those stupid mini games, and I know Janet does too. So, like, if. Ugh, it's always the conundrum of the Switch Online. Like, every time we try to do multiplayer, it just breaks down but if enough of us have hard lines it seems like it'd be a fun fun new show plus option i don't know if it can beat walking episode two but i'm ready to be surprised all right here we go nintendo tweeted it's out now well i was gonna get angry about that but i'm like you know what it, it wouldn't have made it in time for new show plus anyway but i wanted to put it the polls for this week but we missed it by a day but that'll be fun, actually, to do that. And I think Sarah is going to be on the podcast next week, so it seems like a good, good game for her to talk about. You know, if you're in the content mindset. Hello. See, what's fun is just having it at night here, and just everything glowing on the horizon. It's so fun, just little things to see. I'm taking notes for the podcast. Glowing. To guide you around. So fun. Ah, uh, the tweet says that it's coming out tomorrow. Okay. Um, we could go to there. We could go to there. But we do need to get over to there. So let's just, let's not rock the casbah here. Let's just keep it simple. Unless that's one of those stamina fruits. Then I'm interested in rocking the casbah. Oh, hello. Oh, that wasn't something in the tree. <gasps> Crap. Okay. Let me become thee, my rock, my mountain. I love, like, the little launch you get out of it. It is out now. Okay, you... Now we're all over the place. You're playing it on Switch right now. Yeah, but still. That's sweet. I love Pokemon Stadium. Oh, is he down and out? And other lines from the game. Um, all right, we got a long way to go. Short time to get there, everybody. Oh, wait a minute. Which is why we need one thing. Nope, not you. Come here, buddy. Yes! Sprint, you fool. Here we go. Now we're gaming. <laughs> come on come on climb the thing climb the thing I see this I see this over here what are you oh I've already been there hello I don't want to fight you I don't want to fight you I got no beef with you buddy Still going strong. How far can we get on this cool, cool elk? I feel like my meter's barely going down. What's happening? This is a magic deer. Oh! <laughs> what else do you want in a game? That's it. That's it. What a delight. Thank you, Kanifu. I will check out Wall World. I promise. That seems like a great Steam Deck game to, to fire up here. I swear it. I swear it on you. Okay, let's head up here. Ask.com is to learn out. I don't know if I ever used that one. Maybe I did. It's been a while. There you go, sickos. You like that? Get on up here. I'll take this. Unpossess is a really funny word. Alright, so 
Tiki's down here. Oh, hang on, we should get a rock to get down this hill better. Like a big rock like this. Ah! Oh, my boat is lost, isn't it? We can we can find it. We can find a dock. Oh, wait. Where I'm supposed to go is right here. Oh, ho, 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 ho. hello, my sweet. All right. Wrong button. Dingus. What do you think? Is it gonna be another stealth thing? Will they repeat the gameplay? I'd be fine with that. That was a fun little weird thing. Let's see. Let's see. And then we can go back to the city island. But first we have to find a boat. So I need to go to a dock to get that boat. I haven't summoned a boat yet. It'd be nice if we didn't have to run all the way back to that other one. They're all different? Okay, that's cool. Good on them. Oh, yeah, that slingshot. I never use that slingshot. Destroy the flying orbs. Is this a thing? Look at that glow. Okay, those are just fireflies. Right? But then these are also glowing. Hey, Grizzled Gaming. Thanks for being here. This is like, um... It's like the Mario Sunshine little bits of, like, just platforming, you know? Hello. This is some weird UAP shit. Oh, I'll get you, my pretty. I will get you all. Get in line. <laughs> just, just aim at it. Enough, enough of trying to calibrate an arc. Sometimes you just gotta aim at the thing. That's a secret for aiming games. Thanks for the big sub, Orlando Goldbloom. <laughs> Wonderful name. Who would you rather meet, Jeff Goldblum or, Le or Orlando Bloom? Jeff Goldblum is maybe the obvious answer. But maybe, maybe Orlando Bloom wouldn't be a jerk. There's like a 10% chance Orlando Bloom would be a decent human being if you met them. He feels like a dick, doesn't he? There's just something about him. What's Orlando Bloom up to these days? <laughs> Where have you been, dude? He's, he's huge on TikTok. Um, he was on that ferry at the carnival show. Who would I rather possess Chia style? I think Orlando Bloom. Because he's more physical. And then I would green light a new Pirates film where I was a boat. I would sincerely go to Disney in like the minute and a half that I have possessing him Chia style. I'd walk into Disney and be like, I want to make a new Pirates movie. But I'm a boat. And just not crack. I see you. Hey, no bamboo can save you. You're getting bamboozled, buddy. All right, here we go. Again, I'm trying to overthink it. Just shoot at the thing. Just shoot at the thing. Stop trying to put a stupid spin on it. I really miss my leaf. Oh, that's terrifying. All right, we got one over there. Still three of these MFers, huh? 
Okay. I'm not scared. I'm not scared. I'm not scared. These fireflies are very misleading. You'd greenlight the film. It costs $300 million. And I want to actually be turned into a boat. Stick your CG magic, Disney. Aha! Now, if you were the final orb. I bet I could find this if I had 3D audio. Oh my gosh. I see you. Don't make me come over there. I will avatar rock my way over there. Hello. Got it. Mm, got it. Orlando Bloom's dating Katy Perry right now? Like at this moment? Did I did I come from up there? I came from up there, right? Yeah, I think so. Is that, um, I don't, I don't know if I could pick Katy Perry out of a lineup, if I'm being honest. I don't really know celebrities that became celebrities after 2006. Okay, here we go. Mm. They're on a date right now. That's, in, that's impressive. That's really good. That's really good for them. I'm happy for those lads. These lovable lads. Thank you. Thank you for your time. Bring the offerings to me. All right, so we need a boat. I guess my boat isn't too far. It's just right down here. Yeah, I gotta stop just being a baby. Let's go. Let's go get ourselves a boat. Who's the most famous person you know, not in video games? What do you, what do you mean by no? John Pra, really enjoyed this game. John Nee, thank you for the big sub, appreciate it. Watch this, maybe you wanna play this game so bad tonight. Oh good. Yeah, it is just, it's just a good, I wanna call it a zone out game, but maybe that's kind of, wah, condescending for this thing. The most famous person in my phone contacts not from the video game world? I don't know. Um, <laughs> I can't think of anybody special that I'd have in my phone outside of the video game world. Um, guy I went to high school with heckled somebody at a golf tournament and then they made a shot. So but I don't think I have his number in my phone. <laughs> but that's probably the most famous thing. Emails, if that counts. I've emailed with famous people, I guess. Yeah, it was Adam Sandler. That's, that's what I'm looking for. That's it. Um, no, but that's very flattering, you would think. Dan Rickard's famous in the wrestling world. That's interesting. That could count, that could count. Can I not take, can I not control it in Anner? I thought for sure. Do I have to shake it out of there? Yep. Good game, good game. Okay, here we go. I do have Steve Wozniak's email address. Ooh, hang on. Yeah, Steve Wozniak's wife did call me on my phone. So that's what it is. I technically have Steve Wozniak's wife's number. So I will accept that. I will accept that as the most famous person. That's a very silly angle for fame. Uh, where am I going? I'm going south here. Um, is this right? Is this the right level of south? Nope, hang on, hang on. This is hardly south at all, you fool. 
Turn around! Turn around! Donk. Okay. Bring this down. Push the frickin' boat out of here. Let's spin this sucker. Okay. Went to school with Lil B. Based God. I don't know who that is, but I bet they're a very neat person. And based is a word you'd use to describe something. Is that called an adjective? No boat damage in this, like, dredge. I damaged boats so many times leaving a dock. Yeah. Yeah, I'm constantly doing a little number in dredge. I have destroyed that boat so many damn times. All right, let's crank it. Let's crank it. All right, so we're going to the big M in the sky on the other island here. Hey, friends. Uh, gee, those aren't people. Those are sticks. Those are sticks in the sand and you look like an asshole. <laughs> okay, see you later, bodies. Human bodies. Love no boat damage. Is there fall damage in this game? I haven't really been testing it. Will there be a deepest dredge? That would have been a fun one for a deepest dive. Don't think anybody would have cared about it, but it would have been fun in theory. And, you know, maybe we can kind of do... You can fast travel from a dock to another dock. Well, that sounds like a great idea. Can I get... Let's do that. <laughs> We're just right here, huh? I was ready to sail the open, open seas, but that's fine. There is fall damage, okay. Uh, but anyways, the deepest dive on Dredge, um, you know, that's something that seems tailor-made for like, you know, we can talk about it on the podcast once Sarah's played it, because I know she's looking forward to it, but she's been really busy. But um, we can kind of unpack it on the podcast and kind of treat it like a little mini deepest dive. I'd be, I'd be on board for that. I think that sounds fun. It'll give me time to, to beat it too, because I would certainly like to. Hello. I brought my ship in. And I'm swimming around your dock. Don't mind me, friends. I would like to use this dock. Let's freaking fast travel. Let's go back to Amon. Um, I'd like to nominate a space for the Unbound for the deepest dive. There is. I mean, if I would have known everything, I mean, it would have tanked so hard views-wise, but I guess we don't need to be fully committed to that. But um, I really like that game. I do think it'd be an interesting one for the deepest dive. But I already know how it ends and all that stuff, so maybe not as effective. And plus, like, I really love that game, but I think that... I think for most of that deepest dive, I would have just been like, uh... Something's happening here, but I don't really understand what. Like, I, I feel like I'm missing out on some core story perspective. Um... And I think maybe the game's kind of designed that way, you know? But still, I felt so stupid throughout most of it, so I would have been really self-conscious doing a deepest dive on it, because I'd be like, uh, something's happening? There's a lot of names that I don't really understand. I thought this person was this person, then they're this person. A lot of that fun stuff. All right, bye, chair. Um, but then by the end, you're like, oh, okay. I see what's going on here. So that... It, it, you know what? It's, it would have been better for like a max spoilers, I think, but I think too much time has passed and I don't think anybody else beat it. I think Kelsey said she wanted to start it. I don't think anybody else beat it, yeah. That's one that I'm going to be screaming about for two tens, I'd imagine. That's so weird after you've been on the island to see this type of stuff again. A city. I see. And then back to French. Can you check and see on PS5 easily, like, how much, um... How many hours you spent on something? 
What's the criteria for nominating a deepest dive? It's just a loose conversation. Sometimes the community has a suggestion that makes sense that we didn't think of. Like, I think the community suggested Animal Crossing. That came out and was like, oh yeah, of course. I, I've been too focused on story stuff. Hold the PlayStation button. Don't mind me. Um, 27%, five hours in Chia. Okay, that's nice. I, that's nice that it's right there. Um, Pixelated Soul is recommending Space for the Inbound. Yeah, bad name. Bad name, but so good. Ooh, she's got the, got the gift, too. Easy. This isn't DMC. <laughs> sure, okay. What is this character? Light him up, Chia. No. Cool. I didn't kill my wife. Everyone thought it was a wholesome story. Not quite, not quite. I want to play a lot more of this game now. No! This in Dredge I'd like to beat. No, 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 But then Minecraft Legends is coming out soon. There's a lot of good stuff. I'm glad we wrapped up Resident Evil 4. Free up some time. Right here, Burning Shores, that's right. place. Are we underwater right now? Yes, we are. Kind of, sort of. What an odd thing. Oh, okay. Yeah, it's definitely time to finish the smaller games while we can, you know. Fun, 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 fun. Amela iti mwaken ke iti unapan angatia isaito ichele iti idi ne me iti hat ati ne tu angataloi e tu ame tu te angat oni me sa te angat. People are digging this. Good, good, good. Hey, if you've never seen Chia, I'm glad you're glad you're seeing it now. humans. That's so cool. I like the little weird reverberations when they talk. Yep, 
That's right. <gasps> okay, bye, headless chicken. Don't do a deepest dive in Final Fantasy 16. Um, because then you'd have to purchase a PS5. Good news for you, we're not gonna do a deepest dive on Final Fantasy 16. I know it makes sense to do it, but we can we can talk about it down the road. Gonna free the little play of the ukulele. Oh my god. Yep. Perfect. Perfect, 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 perfect. <laughs> 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 Oh boy. This little karaoke night. It's funny. That's funny. We have to be best buds at this point. Come on. I'm wowing you. Oh. <laughs> yep. Good game. I wish I made this sound good. Ten out of ten. Orlando says in a few beers, but I think I need to play this. Yeah, I think um Look, you do what you want with your body, but, uh, I think you might be right. Who is this fella? Get out of here. I mean, this old woman. Get out of here. Rare aesthetic. That's interesting. That's an interesting comparison. I hadn't thought of it like that. Get one pearl. Well, are we... Is this water? Okay, I'm confused. I'm confused about what we are and where we are. I guess that's kind of the point, huh? Can it be played with an instrument-shaped controller? Sure, whatever you want. Whatever you want to play it on, it's fair game. All right, that's gonna be a treasure down there, but let's see. Oh, I see you, Pearl. I see you, Pearl. Take this, take this, take this. Coach, yeah. We'll be back for the Pearl. We'll be back for the Pearl. I've died in the water before and it is terrifying. Okay. Full health, here we go. Can't lose. Oh, can we get to this Pearl in time? This way, Chia. This way. Come on, don't be a little jank. Don't be a little jank here. Will we ever see Everwild again? God, I hope so. I hope during the Xbox thing this summer, whatever they have, right? I'm hoping we get to see some cool stuff. All right, let's see. What do these trinkets do? Is that just a collectible? Meet the old lady. <laughs> All right, don't mind if I do. Where was she? Also, where on the map am I? Aha! Alright, let's go find this lady. Thank you. Thank you, Chia. Thank you for your guidance. Um, alright. I'll get more of these trinkets. Don't mind if I do get more of the trinkets, actually. I don't mind that. I don't mind that none. 
All right. So can we climb this wall? Or we just gonna walk over here? Is this gonna be scary? Nope. It's not gonna be scary, everybody. Hey, music people. This game isn't here to scare ya. Oh, there's a big old totem thing back there. <laughs> Resident Evil 4 flashbacks in the village, that's funny. It does kind of look like that, don't it? Diving area, okay. Hope you like what we got for ya. Tu es la bienvenue ici, Chia. Mon nom est Kaveri. Good God. C'est un Retiwa, une créature très rare. Ils existaient bien avant nous et peuvent voir à travers le temps et l'espace. But they still like to be pet. Présent et futur. Yeah, so there's two languages in the game. It's French and then whatever the other language is. I'm sorry, I forget the name. Mais nourris-les une fois et ils viendront réclamer. I'd like to do this. Ish. So we're kind of underwater. Je sais ce que tu recherches, Chia, mais il y a des choses que tu dois savoir. Suis-moi. Chia's face is always so funny. It's just, it's just so tune link, you know. Le bagnon est le foyer des esprits, du temps et de la mémoire. Dans ses racines, tu trouveras les réponses à tes questions. Drehu is the other language, thank you. Drehu! I haven't finished the game yet, no, so yeah, we just checked the clock. We're like five, six hours in? Something like that. I should have. I should have beat the game by now. But Resident Evil took a toll on me. <laughs> Time for a little backstory. Have you finished it, Uber? Did you like Chia? Did you like Chia, Uber? Okay. Picking up what you're putting down. It's long hair for a newborn child. Yeah, babies should be born, if you think about it. Nine months is a pretty long time. They should have a flowing mane. They have more metal babies, yeah. Carefully, walk carefully. Inela kakola kwenla eleni me avora. Inela nod na upela dohu me isola tungo nila nazae na opihu ala ede. Oh, 
Oh, party invite show. Thank you for the raid. Welcome. We're playing Chia. We're like five or six hours in. We're playing on PS5. What were we all playing over there? Party invite show. Bad, don't do it. Oh, you shouldn't scratch up a bamboo stalk because it hurts them? Like the trees die? Normally the game's like fun and you're like running around and turning into animals and stuff. This is like a story sequence, everybody. Good God. <laughs> Yeah, the MinMax Show's channel is out of control with photoshops of Jeff I'm sitting. <laughs> We'd used that picture before on Instagram, but I guess Bob Buell just saw it on Twitter or something. And everyone's lost their mind in that Discord. MinMax community, you're crazy up in that Discord. But it's very fun to see. Know that person? We've seen that feathered friend before. No, I appreciate bamboo facts. I appreciate bamboo facts, Danny. Your bamboo facts are welcome anytime, any time of the day. Oh. Credits. This is a lot of story for Chia. It, it definitely is. And a lot of loading for the PS5. Remember when they said there wasn't going to be a loading for the PS5? Oh. Banyan. Um, it does sound fun, but I don't think I want to do that right now. Um, where is the queen? Where is the queen? Why, she's this way, little Chia. And I hope she quizzes us on everything we learned in the forest. That's my dream. That's what I'm hoping for. Good stuff, good stuff, good stuff. We need the trinket. All right. Chirrip, chirrip. I don't think they ever said zero loading for the PS5, but I'd be interested in seeing their wording. It was very much implied loading was a thing of the past, was it not? We don't want to do this right now. No loading on PS5 seemed to stop after Rift Apart. Yeah, that is interesting. But there really haven't been, the, been that many PS5 exclusives, you know? Except for Rift Apart and Je Returnal, but that's on PC now, I guess. Mais je ne suis pas celle qui doit y répondre. Um, I've never really listened to a lot of pop music. Jake I don't know where people listen to it. Awakens. To a awaken, they can be found hidden all over the They cast fiery spells. That's interesting. Don't mind if I do. Ah! Oh, excellent. Excellent. Okay, so this makes more sense with the combat. Because I was like, why? Am I just controlling a lamp the entire time? Retrouve-moi sur la plage. J'ai quelque chose pour toi. 
That certainly makes more sense. TikTok's the main avenue for new music? Yeah, not not interested. I'm sure it's great. I should I should probably listen to more music in my life. But alas, no one's perfect. Um, well we gotta get this at the top. I don't know if we can make it though. Oh god, godi, 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 godi. Okay. Take your time. Rest up. Rest up, Chia. We gotta get that face paint off you, sister. Oh, this is scary. Well, that was also scary because I fell. This is like the 16th Colossus here, y'all. Alright. Head on up. Head on up. We just need this. We just need this. Now I mainly stay abreast by listening to New York Times podcast for music. New York Times has a music podcast? Sounds cool. Sounds cool. Coming in. Thank you for teaching me the beauty of the awakens. M awakens? Moikens? What is my boat doing here? Écoute, Chia. Tu as mimé Avora très en colère. Et il va essayer de t'atteindre en attaquant ce que tu Je as. sais, je sais, je dois partir. Mais... Goodbye. Attends Il y a quelqu'un que... Je t'empresse, je dois y aller. Je reviendrai. C'est promis. We like you. A little bit. That's a fun image. Choco Chia a télévent. Gotta find it. That is what's going on. You, you, you're not wrong. All right, so Louise is where? That's how loud it can get. Sorry. Alright, let's go around. Um, oh, there's probably a shortcut. But, F it, let's go around the whole island. Which game has the best clouds? Does Horizon probably take it at this point? I don't know. This game is so smart. So smart with the music. Horizon or Red Dead 2. Yeah. All right, everybody. I feel like that's a good place to stop. Oh, I said that's a good place to stop. Chapter six. Chapter six is where we're at. Um, if you want to remember all that. Uh, thanks to everybody for sticking with us through all the uh, audio issues. Uh, I'm glad you're all so much more patient than I am in so many ways. Thanks for watching a little surprise bonus stream. Um, yeah, we'll be talking about Chia more on the Midnight Show podcast. Which, again, won't be going live until Thursday due to an embargo. Not our choice. Not our choice. We're not happy about it. Uh, but let's see. Uh, let's, uh, let's raid uh, Janet here. Janet's playing the Minish Cap. What an interesting choice. Uh, didn't we just talk about this on the podcast a while ago? We did a little mini Deepest Dive for this. And she was on it, wasn't she? That's cool that she's continuing to play that, though. But All right, go say hi to Janet. Thanks so much, everybody. Bye.